Hello, welcome to an e-demo on bulk configuration in Illustrator Connect version 3. So the first thing you're going to see when you launch Illustrator Connect is this screen and it allows you to select which IP range to scan for cameras. There's a couple of options at the top of this dialog which allow you to choose IP version 4, IP version 6 or both to scan on. And then underneath that you have a list of all of the network cards in your machine. So what you need to do is uncheck the boxes next to the cards you don't want to scan on. So I'm going to uncheck all except this one here. And then moving down the dialog we have a selection for which protocol of camera we want to scan for. I'm just going to change that to all protocols. And then finally we have a section which allows us to enter a username and password if any of our cameras are security enabled. With all of that configured I'm going to choose OK. And Illustrator Connect is then going to scan the network for devices. When it finds devices, it is going to query them for their information. And it's going to provide us a list of all of the devices which have been found on the specified network. And you can see here we have the list. And in there we have a lot of information about the camera. So we have the device name. We have its status indicated on the icon on the far left hand side. We also have its IP address. We even have what firmware version it's running and its MAC address as well. What we can do is we can select multiple cameras at once using our control or shift keys on our keyboard and we can choose the bulk configuration button at the top here and it's going to open up a pane which allows us to configure some settings for the camera. On the left hand side in this dialog we have all of our selected cameras listed. On the right hand side we have some settings listed and what we can do is we can add settings from this drop down we're going to choose the setting and then in the next drop down we can choose the parameter value and we can just add that to the settings and if we choose apply settings that will apply those settings in the pane above to all of the selected cameras.